Bioenergy Conversion Global holds the worldwide license rights for the marketing and use of the proprietary TEA process from Tucker Engineering Associates, with the exception of the Bahamas. The TEA process is an exciting new proprietary green energy system that sits poised to change the renewable energy world, as it solves a multitude of problems incurred by prior waste to energy processes. The TEA process consists of a unique patented gasification system, which utilizes an age-old proven process, pyrolysis, while employing proprietary leading-edge control systems to sequester noxious elements and produce environmentally friendly products. It represents a paradigm shift from traditional processes as it utilizes a clean energy-only approach, rather than the maximize energy but pollute methods others embrace. It does this by removing only the clean volatiles from organic materials and leaves behind the noxious products and a fixed carbon byproduct. These noxious compounds are permanently bonded within the carbon, so there is no chance of them leaching into the environment. The amount of carbon removed from the feedstock varies from 20 to 45 percent, and by doing so, enables the TEA process to actually have a negative carbon footprint by preventing these amounts from being exhausted into the atmosphere. The TEA gasifier consumes 20 to 25 tons of feedstock per day and produces a gas very similar to natural gas, as well as useful carbon products. It can produce up to 1.5 megawatts of electricity. In addition, it sequesters noxious elements and compounds permanently within the resultant carbon. These include mercury, sulfur, and halogens, and these will not leach into the landfills, air, or the earth. The TEA process is capable of consuming a wide variety of organic and synthetic carbon-based feedstocks. Virtually all biomass products, such as wood chips, rice husks, and plant refuse can be processed. The TEA process will help eliminate landfills as it produces energy from municipal solid waste, while preventing the escape of raw methane into the atmosphere produced by rotting garbage. Coal is an energy-dense feedstock and is processed without the problems of pollution that plague today's large coal-fired power plants. Mercury, sulfur, and other pollutants from coal are sequestered within the remaining resultant carbon permanently, making the TEA process a truly clean coal technology. Municipal wastewater sludge can also be processed to yield clean methane and benign carbon products. Oil and oil sludges can be injected into the gasifier to increase the BTU content of the gas. PCBs, contaminated soil, and other hazardous wastes can be rendered non-hazardous by the TEA process. The gasifier is also mobile and scalable, measuring only 8 feet wide by 16 feet long by 12 feet tall. It can fit onto a flatbed truck or trailer, or into a shipping container or cargo aircraft. It can be moved from site to site as needed, and additional units can be installed to produce more gas or power. Parasitic loads of the system are approximately 15% of the gas and 12% of the electricity produced. Unlike most gasification processes that produce a carbon monoxide based syngas, the TEA process produces a gas made up primarily of methane, which is very similar to natural gas. A major advantage of methane is its ease of storage for use at a later time. Syngas is typically immediately burned as a fuel because it is not stored easily. By storing methane in a tank farm, it can be used when needed, which is especially useful when producing electricity. This provides excellent peak grid load performance by creating and storing excess gas during nighttime and utilizing it to generate more electricity during daylight hours. This ability also makes the TEA process an outstanding complement to wind and solar installations, as they are a variable in output, and the TEA gasifier can load follow as needed. In addition to being used to generate electricity, the methane can be utilized to fuel compressed natural gas vehicles, heat boilers, produce hot water or steam, or to heat houses or other buildings. The TEA process produces two distinct types of carbon, and both are useful and generate a substantial profit. Activated carbon is produced from biomass, MSW, biosolids, and red medical waste. 
biomass and animal waste yield the best activation levels, with the others somewhat less, and activation numbers can be increased through steam injection within the TEA process. Activated carbon is utilized for a variety of needs, including filtering chemicals, water, and plant smokestacks. Non-wetting carbon is patented by TEA and is produced primarily from coal. It can also be made from other feedstocks when proprietary agents are introduced into the system. Non-wetting carbon is used to produce valuable end products, such as a TEA patented waterproof lumber, known as carbon reinforced lumber. The other component of this lumber is high density polyethylene from plastic bottles recycled from landfills. This lumber will not warp, mold, or mildew like typical wood in plastic composite lumber and can be used in underwater or in-ground applications. In addition, use of this unique composite lumber will reduce deforestation around the world. Waste heat from the gasifier burners can be utilized to heat a secondary gasifier to increase throughput, heat a vacuum distillation system for tire recycling, heat a closed loop cleaning system for waste aluminum cans, preheat and condition feedstock for proper moisture content, create steam for use in a combined cycle turbine generator or distillation into pure water, and heat hot water for heating buildings or domestic use. What sets the TEA process apart from other waste to energy systems? It is more profitable than any other waste to energy system. It is mobile, modular, and scalable. It has a wide variety of feedstock options. Yields a clean gas with low emissions when burned. It permanently sequesters noxious materials, which are then non-leachable, and produces unique, valuable carbon and carbon end products. The TEA process is an exceptionally green energy conversion system. It brings to the industry a true clean coal technology and utilizes numerous waste feedstocks to create a gas similar to natural gas that burns cleaner than any other petroleum-based fuel. The carbon products enable a revenue stream that creates an anomaly in the waste to energy industry, one that actually makes money, and the patented composite plastic lumber eliminates much of the plastic in landfills as well as reduces deforestation. In addition, the building of TEA plants will create much needed jobs in construction, operation, and maintenance. The world and the environment will benefit greatly from the TEA process.